at Simmer Sweets here and welcome back to my jungle adventure. This is part three and we are in an, a new area and we found a treasure chest and so she got some simoleons and put some adventure gear in her inventory. So, but yeah, right now I have them going and clearing out some rocks and some different things like that because, you know... I mean, normally this, I wouldn't say that this, like, you know, collecting these is not part of the adventures because, you know, it's always been there. However, we are down to like 200 simoleons from all the supplies and things that we've been having to buy. So, um, anything that we can get, I'm going to take. So, I've even thought about having them do some fishing, but I'm just not sure. <laughs> so, um... Yeah, so for right now, we're just exploring different areas and getting some things that we can sell. Um, of course, you know, there is some that I don't want to sell, like, um, let's see, yeah, Everett. He did something with a rock, and he ended up with a fossil. It's, it's worth 110, but it's a fossilized crocodile jaw, and I just don't know if I want to to get rid of that you know and that's like part of this whole adventure thing so yeah I just don't know what I want to do with that right now so okay um now we need to find another area for them to explore um da -dum, da -dum, da -dum. there seems to be a lot but yet I don't know I'm I just I don't know I don't know guys <laughs> Okay, so there's a rock over there, but what I'm going to have him do is I'm going to have him come over here and clear a path with the machete, and then while he's doing that, I'm going to have him come over here and dig, dig on that, and yeah, let's follow them around, see what they're doing. Do, 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 do. I'm so excited. Um, my plan was to get some tents and some coolers and stuff and just have them keep carting them around and then never really having to leave the exploring area, you know, just kind of camp out in the wilderness. That was my plan, but we just didn't have enough simoleons to do all of that. So that's why I'm having them clear out these rocks and stuff so we can get some more simoleons. I'm super excited because um, I really want to devil into this more because I know that there's temples and with like mazes and all sorts of things to do and I want to get into some of that you guys it's going to be fun um okay I'm gonna have her go here so that she can hang out with him I wonder if she can yeah she can't examine these and Ooh, what's up with the music uh-oh should I be worried Everett was forging through some thick vines a little too enthusiastically when his machete flew out of his hands and was lost forever in the thick jungle. Oh, Everett, what were you thinking? Okay, suddenly sloths. As Everett rounds the corner, there's a stillness in the air. He looks up and notices a bed of sloths watching him. Everett is distracted for a moment and walks into a low-hanging branch, releasing a small band of fiery flies which fly at the sloths and begin to bother them scorching their fur in spots what should everett do let nature be distract flies with a dance <laughs> or mist the flies um hmm we're gonna mist the flies Okay, Everett remembers the mister he's carrying and whips it out. After a few sprays into the flies, they disperse and leave the sloths alone. Everett dispenses with the now empty mister, but not before noticing that the sloths seem to have dropped a number of crystals for him. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, yes, yes, we get to travel to a temple. Yes, 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 yes. Take her with you, take her with you. Yes, you guys, we're going to a temple. Mm, yeah, so excited. A temple, finally. And they have nothing to treat poison. So, crap. <laughs> Say hello to our first temple. Let's take a quick look here. A looky-see at this beautiful temple. So, here it is, you guys. That is amazing. I can't wait to go inside and look around. And, ooh, it's going to be fun. But before we do that, Everett and Everett and Kiara are going to woohoo in a bush. Because they have yet to woohoo in a bush. So that's what they're going to do. I'm going to have them come over here and woohoo in a bush. 
Nobody's around. We can get away with it. <laughs> and he goes, and she goes. There's the little doves, the little hearts. Aww. That's so cute. I feel like a peeping Tom this up close, you know? I just, I can't help it. Yay! This is the temple of love. <laughs> <laughs> At least that's what I'm calling it. It's the temple of love. Wow, are they done yet? That's a lot of hearts. <laughs> oh, and there's the fireworks. Oh yeah. I want to get them like, like sneaking out of the bush. Here he comes. Here she comes. Yay! Out of the bushes they come. And he's feeling pretty happy with himself. Okay, and now they're very focused. Hmm. Very focused. I want to kind of check the grounds a little bit around here. I want to see if there's any chests or like, yeah. Okay. So for Everett, I'm going to have him excavate. And let's see what we can possibly have her do. Um, I could have her ex excavate as well, but I just, I don't know. I just don't know. I wish there was a way, again, that I could get her to go off the beaten path because that's like part of her her thing, you know, to, to do that. So, but she can come in and like examine things. Activate or examine. Let's examine. Oh, no, I don't want him to examine that. I want her. Well, she probably has to go inside the building, yeah, to do that. Hmm. Okay, what is she doing? She is... She's viewing. She's viewing all the pretty views. She's going in, guys. She's going in. Oh, she's going down a floor. Okay. Hmm. Something tells me she's not gonna want to try to pass that. <gasps> no, 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 no. Don't try to. Don't. No. 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 Examine that. That's a girl. <laughs> Um, she probably has to activate both of those, to be honest. Um, and he's still digging for stuff. And I want him to do all of these. I'm pretty sure he gets experience for them. Yeah, he does. While excavating, Everett found an unauthenticated vase. Yes, bring in some dough, you guys. Bring in some dough. Um, and what is she doing? Let's go back to her. Did she activate it? Continue examining. That works. So because she wants to do some of that, um, she wants to achieve a level three of the culture skill. Um, she wants to find an area off the path. See, that's the one that I can't seem to get. Travel deep into the jungle. Clear and pass through the path obstacles to discover hidden areas off the main path as you trek towards the um Sian temple hmm and examine three traps so we definitely have to examine traps okay Kira figured out that some of these triggers won't work to unlock the gate but that doesn't rule them out all out. Kara could try her luck by activating a trigger or keep examining other mechanisms let's there's another one over here so let's have her go ahead and examine this one yeah we're gonna have her examine that one and he's gonna keep on digging 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 um he found another authenticated oh we found an authenticated statue um so we're gonna get rid of these crystals because this is gonna give us more money so let's go ahead and do that um that's 85 any money is better than no money. Um, hey, no, I want to do that. Uh, 69. No, I want to sell this item. Um, a vase worth 67. We'll go ahead and sell that as well. So, again, some things I'm going to keep and some I'm going to get rid of. What's this? A 
Zanatula relic. No. What? He has to pee? He has to pee? Pee later, dude. Pee later. There's plenty of bushes around here for him to do that. Okay, and then I want her to continue examining that. So, and then she can just chill, chill around and, I don't know. It's such a pretty area. Well, Drat, none of these triggers will unlock the gate. Gotta try examining another. Is there another? Is there another for her to examine? I don't know. I guess there must be one upstairs. So let's see. Let's see if there's something upstairs. Another upstairs? What's this? Um, hmm. I don't think there's another upstairs. Oh, hmm. This is quite interesting. What's he gonna do? Who's gonna chat? No. Once you're done doing that, I want you to come, or we'll use the bush that we didn't um, woohoo in. And then I'm gonna have him come over here and excavate that. And then, I don't know, I think I'm gonna have her come over just like, can she, can she come over here? Go here, I guess. So she's gonna fertilize as well. And, and what is he doing? He's napping in a bush. Well, you know, I guess that works. <laughs> Go ahead, nap in a bush, nap in a bush. Um, and, No, 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 no. I want her to... I'm not letting her do it. Why can't she do it? That's weird. But he can. Study for historical insight. And then study for historical insight as well. I don't know. You know, I think I'm just going to go ahead and have... Now she's going to sleep. She's going to go to sleep and then swim laps again. Okay, no. Let's go into our inventory and let's eat grilled cheese. Ready to eat grilled cheese. And sell our ruby. And fossil rock extract fossil. And uncovered this item. Uh, one perfectly preserved mustache. Ugh. And I really do not, I have no clue what he's doing. So I'm just going to have her come over here. She really wants to swim to get some of her hygiene up. And I mean, it, it is late. Oh, and he's hungry. Okay, so what I'm going to have him, what I'm going to have him do is in her inventory, she has one of these. I'm going to go ahead and give it to Everett so that he can eat. He's going to eat grilled cheese ready to eat. And then after that, he's going to come over and sleep and he's going to nap in that bush. And she is going to nap in this bush and I'm just going to keep having them nap. And I don't know what I'm going to do about food, but I'm just going to go ahead and let them nap and then I'll do that. So while they're napping in the bushes, we have got a skeleton running around the, the forest. And this is a temple guardian, Ribby Esquilipto. And I wonder what he's going to do. But it is our first skeleton. Ah, he's going up the stairs. But then what, is he gonna go down is he going to go down? I don't know. I don't know. I'd like to know, though. Come on. And of course, you know, he doesn't need to deactivate anything. He's just going to go right through. Or is he going to activate something? Hmm. What's he going to do, guys? I wonder if we end up have to, having to fight him. Temple Guardian. 
No. What is she gonna do? She wants to view something. I'm just gonna go ahead and let her view it because that's part of what she does. Oh, and the skeleton didn't do nothing. <laughs> And then I'm probably just going to end up having her who wants to come and hug her. Aww. Study for historical insight. And I'm just going to do it. She's going to activate it. Um, reach into arrowhead glimpse hole. Let's see what happens. She's bypassed the temple's defenses and the gate has been opened. And now she can venture further in. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, so now let's do that. Both of them. Okay, so we're going to go here together. And hopefully he's going to go do that. Yeah. And the skeleton's already going down, of course. We're going to excavate that. And it's like a little altar thing, but nothing else is really going on here. I hope there's no floor traps. That would stink. Hmm. What is this? Let's examine it. He's dancing with his bones. <laughs> that is so funny. And then we got another place that we can go down again. Woohoo! I really got to. Oh, what is she doing? I'm gonna pass like? Is gonna like freak out? Skeleton! <laughs> they are gonna die of hunger. Oh look. It the skeleton's talking with them like it's no big deal. He's like gonna be freaking out too. He, he's chatting with Ribby. Ribby the skeleton. They must be having a very interesting conversation, the two of them. And now Ribby is doing push ups. <laughs> I love it. Mm. At least we're getting some money back. We're we're back up to a thousand. Okay, and Kira figured out. Hold on, Kira figured out that some of these triggers won't work to unlock the gate, but that doesn't rule them all out. Kira could try her luck by activating a trigger or keep examining other mechanisms. I don't see any other mechanisms. So she's just going to have to try her luck. So we're going to activate. Oh, and she can't, she can't step on any, she can't, what? Well, that stinks. Fine. Study historical insight and then hopefully that'll up her chances with other stuff. And then, I don't know what else there is to study for her to study. What is she doing? Oh, wait, no, that was going to be him. Why can't she study these? I mean, he can, but she can't, which is just odd. So I'm going to have her come back up here, and we're going to activate this one. Although these are all, they've got, like, bad thumbs. So I don't know if we really want to do that. What's she going to do? She wants to go back and nap. That's fine. It's like two something in the morning. Um, he wants to nap too. No, why don't you come here and excavate that real quick. Yeah. And then I think I'm just going to have to send them home and then let them rest up and get something to eat and then come back out here fresh because, yeah, hmm. I just don't know what else to do. They're going to, like, starve to death. And I don't know if there's any, like, if they can pick berries or anything around here. I don't know. And I don't want them to starve to death because that would just stink. He's really tired. But I'm going to have him. Let's that. 
Yeah, I might just have to have them sleep and come back, you guys, because, yeah, they really need the tent and the, and the other thing. Oh, great, what, what's going on with him? There's something in the air, and that something is a whole bunch of lightning bugs. Everett smiles, remembering the lightning insulation powder he has and prepares to diffuse whatever shocking effects these bugs have in store. Sweet! Okay, fine. You know what? Come nap for just a tiny bit, and then you guys are going to go home because you guys are just out of it. Completely out of it. She wants to go swim. We'll let her do some swimming. Okay. Um, okay, they need to go home. Both of them need to go home. So go home. Go home. Go home. Okay, so we're back here at the at the temple and let's see if we can get them through this other gate so um, I, I went ahead and I gave them 24 hours back at home just to get like all of their needs up as, as good as I could and um, I'm gonna try some other stuff and I don't know, hopefully, I made them a pack lunch and stuff, so hopefully we can get that all taken care of. Um, oh, she can't, can, this has already been examined, and we're just going to step on it with flirtiness and see what happens. <laughs> I mean, although it's green, so I have a feeling something bad's going to happen, but we are going to attempt it anyways, and we'll, we shall see. Here she comes. What's going to happen? I'm almost nervous. Oh, did it work? What? It worked? Alright, I'll take it. Don't go through it. What is she doing? She wants to view something. Um, hmm. I don't know. Your husband's excavating right now, so let's let him finish doing that. Because we are now officially broke. I went ahead and bought them both a machete. And ancient bone dust. Hmm. Okay. Anyways, we're going to go through here. We are going to go through here. She wanted to examine these. That's fine. Um, examine those. And let's see. We need him to do something too, don't we? I'm not sure what though. Let's go ahead and have him examine the plate then. You'll come over here and you'll examine the plate and then that way they're both examining something and we'll see what we can do. So, um, yay, she gained another skill level. Let's see where she's at. Okay, yep. Uncover artifact from a dirt clump. That's all that he needs to do. And I could have sworn he already did that. Okay, you gotta place a dirt clump on an archaeological table click on the drink clump and then select uncover okay so we have a couple of those we just don't have any table and they're like 400 simoleons and we don't have 400 simoleons so yeah he needs to examine that when's he gonna get down here and do that hello there you go <laughs> um and then she examined something, um, and she can't continue examining it. Okay, Kira figured out that some of these triggers won't work to unlock the gate, but that doesn't rule them all out. Kiara could try her luck by activating a trigger or keep examining other me mechanisms. Okay, so we are just going to have her go fertilize a bush so that she doesn't wet herself. That's probably a really good idea. So we'll go have her do that. Um, it's... Too early. Okay, confound it. Everett learned nothing from examining. Oh, poor guy. Poor guy. And how is he doing? They're probably gonna end up eating their sack lunches here soon. I just, I have a feeling. <laughs> okay, once she's done using the bathroom, because I don't want to interfere with that. What's he doing now? Is he gonna? He wants to view. That's fine. You can go ahead and view. You can go ahead and view. I don't mind. I'm so excited that we're in this temple. And we're going to figure it out, guys. It's going to happen. I promise. It's going to happen. We're going to get this all done. And let's see how she's doing with her 
um, stuff here. So she still needs to activate, achieve level three, and find an area off the beaten path, which we just haven't done yet. Um, okay, so I want her to come over here, and I want her to... She can't do any of those. Okay, so I want her to come over here and activate... Um, Make an offering to Arrowhead or make an offer to Tree. Let's make an offer to Tree and see what happens. And what is he going to do? He's still feeling focused. Um, you know, I'm going to go ahead and have him eat his lunch. So go ahead and... Oh, uh, what happened? There's something in the air. Oh, there's more lightning bugs. But he's safe. Okay, so unpack your sack lunch and eat it, dude. So hopefully that's what he's going to do. With this. Hopefully that's what they mean by unpacking it. <laughs> okay, eat your peanut butter and jelly sandwich. What a goof. What a goof. What a goof. Okay. Hopefully this works and she ends up activating. I don't, I don't know. Because there was really nothing more for her to examine. Wrong activation. The poison dart sticking out of Kiara's neck means she activated that wrong trigger. Hopefully that woozy feeling will pass soon. <laughs> Oops. Okay, so I guess we'll do the arrowhead one and see if that works. Still wrong activation. Now she's got all sorts of issues going on. The poor girl. And we can't do any of these because, because why? Why won't it let her? This has already been examined. And that's already been examined. Um, hmm. And she can't activate any of these. Let's see why. She must be confident. Must be energized. Must be flirty. And must be inspired. Oh no, she's feeling sick too. Why? What? From eating... <gasps> Were their sack lunches spoiled and I didn't realize it? <gasps> oh, what? Poor girl. So, we need to get them like flirty and energized and stuff like that. Okay, so what I'm going to do is... She's not really going to be feeling flirty and stuff like that, but this, here's what we're going to do. We're going to come over here and... We are going to get romantic so we can get in a flirty mood with each other here. Uh, we're going to flirt and let's blow a kiss and hmm, caress cheek. Watch is going to be the wrong activation. <laughs> and let's see, what else can we do? Um, da -dum, da -dum, da -dum. I don't want to try for a baby in the bush. They're not ready for babies right now. Express fondness. And I'm going to do this all over here by the stairs. I guess that works. Um, embrace. And we just got to get her in a flirty mood. Um, more choices. Whisper seductively. Of course, she's feeling uncomfortable. We're going to flirt some more. If nothing else, maybe he'll maybe he'll become flirty. See, and he's still feeling focused. We need them to get flirty here. Okay. Um, kiss hands. Profess undying love. Um, hold hands. Kiss. Yes, he's feeling flirty. Be enticing. Offer another rose. And then we're going to come over here and we're going to try to step on the plate of flirtiness. Although I think that's the last well, no, I don't think that was the last one we did. So we'll try it and see. And if that doesn't work, it did. It worked. Yes. Yes. What's she doing? She wants to... Getting in line for... Okay. Girl. Okay. 
she forgets that she has a bush here that she can, you know, fertilize. Fertilize the bush. You can do it. Just fertilize that bush. Just go for it. And then I'm going to go over to him here. And let's go into his inventory. Let's place in world. Can I not place it myself? I can. Why is it not giving me a choice to place anywhere though? Why? Like, doesn't like any of the places I want to put it? That's a bummer. Okay, fine. Fine. What's he doing? Quiet look around. Okay, place in the world yourself then. And place that in the world yourself too. So be it, I guess. So be it. Okay. So he wants to go to sleep for a little bit. We'll go ahead and let him do that. And then she's going to fertilize the bush. And then I think she's going to explore some more while he is fertilizing the bush. Or while he's napping. What is she doing again? Stop getting in line, girl. Come over here and examine. Doesn't she have any waters in a can? Or did she use She probably used all hers up. No, she's got two. Hmm. So use waterfall in the bottle after that. She's feeling tired, but I want to let him get some sleep first. And then they can they can switch out. They'll take turns because I don't know if she can sleep in the tent with him. Let's see. Mm, maybe she can. Maybe she can. Oh, is that the same skeleton? No, this is Zygo. Another temple guardian. Zygo. I like it. I like it. This is so awesome. Uh -huh. And she has to get to level three, I believe it is. Or is it level four? And she's 52% complete. That's awesome. I have no clue how long I've been on here. <laughs> no clue whatsoever. Okay. And he's going to have to go to the bathroom soon, which means we're going to have to have him go up and use a bush, I think. And I want her to continue examining. Okay, what's he going to do? He wants to go for a swim. Fine. Go ahead and swim some laps. Okay, Kara figured out that some of these triggers won't work to unlock the gate, but that doesn't rule them all out. Kara could try her luck by activating a trigger or keep examining other mechanisms. Okay. Okay, so he should be swimming and doing all that stuff. And she needs to come over here and she needs to sleep for a while. We should probably get both of them to try to go to sleep here. Because um, he's definitely still tired. But we need to have him focus a little bit more. Okay, so his hygiene is now officially up. And... He wants to no don't view that. Don't don't do that, dude. Why don't you come over here and fertilize one of the bushes over here? We'll do that. We'll fertilize one of the bushes. I like that. Okay, and then I'm gonna have him go to sleep in and then I'm just gonna go ahead and end it this part right here, guys. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this this video. I hope you guys are looking forward to the next part. I know I am. I'm looking forward to deviling more into the um why is he not going to why is oh, I told him to go to maybe I didn't tell him to go to sleep go to sleep anyways I'm looking forward to getting to devil into this temple more and finding even more temples and just getting to do a lot of stuff it's going to be a lot of fun and I'm looking forward to it um and yeah I I just I can't wait and also you guys will notice I went ahead and I changed where this part is at. It, it used to be my not so very challenge right after my 100 baby challenge, but I just don't like my two challenges being back to back. So I wanted to just split them up a little bit. So it's going to be the new, um, the scheduling is going to stay the same, but what I'm doing is I'm changing things around a little bit. So instead of, uh, so it's going to be 100 baby challenge, 
then it's going to be my jungle adventures then it's going to be um the not so berry and then my cats and dogs so yeah anyways i hope you guys enjoy this video i will see um don't forget to hit that notification bell if you guys haven't already done that because it will let you guys know when my videos come out seeing as how i am pregnant and i got a lot going on i got a vacation and may is going to be packed with families coming to visit from far away and um and yeah, I got a baby shower that my daughter's planning and she's only 12. So of course I'm helping, um, you know, and there's just like camp trips and vacations and everything. I mean, May is just going to be insanely crazy. So, um, but I will try my best to get as many videos up as I can, but do not forget to hit that notification bell guys. It's really important. That way you guys will know when my videos come out, seeing as how the, um, uploads are a little unpredictable right now. And if you're new to my channel and you like my channel, please hit that subscribe button. Also, guys, please hit that like button. Um, it's not that hard to just hit that like button. Let me know that you guys are watching. There's not many of you guys um, and everything. And, like, I think I'm only getting one like in all my videos. And it's um, it's making me a little worried, <laughs> to be honest. Um, but if you really do like these videos, if you really do want to be able to see more um, more frequently, more often, you want to see these keep coming, you've got to hit that like button on my videos, guys. You've got to let me know that um, you're liking these and that I, I should keep going on them. Because right now at this point, there's a part of me, honestly, that just wants to give up. Um, but so you guys, hit, please, please, please hit that like button. Let me know that you guys are still there, that you guys are still watching. I would really appreciate it. Anyways, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. Oh.